Hello everyone. Today we will learn how to make a homemade microscope. Remember that a microscope is a very useful instrument to see tiny things. So, for today's activity, we will need the following material. A plastic container, a glass jar, an aluminum foil, a flashlight, and a paper hole punch. With all these materials, we are going to make the main parts of a microscope. As a light source, we will use a flashlight. As a stage, we will use a glass jar. And as the objective and the eyepiece, a drop of water. Also, with the plastic container, we will make the cover slip and the slide. So, we are going to take some scissors and carefully, we will cut two small squares of two centimeters by size. And we are going to cut a larger one of five centimeters by six centimeters. Now we have to cut out the lens holder with the paper hole punch right in the middle of the plastic to do a beautiful hole in the center. Okay, to continue, take some aluminum foil and then you are going to fold it in a rectangular shape as you can see here. Now, when you have folded it enough to be sturdy, make with it a similar structure as you can see here. Okay, the next step is to place it into the jar. After that, you will add some water in the hole of the lens holder. Your drop of water has to have a spheric form. This is the secret to make your microscope work very well. In this step, you have to make sure that the drop of water works. As you can see here, you have to look through the hole and while you do this, uh, the drop of water mustn't fall. In this part of the experiment, you need to place the sample in between the cover slip and the slide, as if you were doing a little sandwich. Finally, it is complete. You have all the main parts that microscopes need to work correctly. Now is your turn. Turn on the flashlight and if you want, you can put two pens under the sample to support the lens holder. The pens help you to give a good high over the sample to get the best focus. And look at this! These are my examples. I found some interesting things in the water. Okay guys, that's all for today. I'll see you next time. Bye-bye.